Hi everyone, this is William from SkySiv and in this video we're going to be looking at line shapes. So line shapes are a different way to specify your own type of custom shape. Whereas in the previous video where we talked about point shapes, point shapes specify the corners of a polygon and plots that for you. Line shapes however are different. You simply specify the path of your points you specify a thickness and the function creates for you a polygon based on that path and that thickness. Now I'm going to create a different type of shape by changing some of the values in this data sheet. So in this data sheet you'll notice that every row represents a point and every point is specified by a Z coordinate and a Y coordinate which are the horizontal and vertical axes respectively. So I'm just going to change this around a little bit. So now that I'm ready, I'm going to hit the submit button. And as you can see, from points 1 to 5, I've created a polygon with a thickness of 4 based on this path. Now, I don't want to stop here. I want to add an additional point. So I know that I've left off at point 5, and I'm going to add a sixth point. And just like that, you've created an extension to the previous polygon that you've made. Now this is handy especially to model folded sections. So to do that I'm going to um, increase the thickness a little bit and I want this to be, instead of being a sharp corner, I want to make this a smooth curve. So I'm going to do this by adding a general fillet. So a general fillet of 2 allows me to create this folded transition between each of the lines. So this is another way to quick and easily specify your own custom shape, um, different to how you would specify a point shape, but with the same ease of use. So thanks for um, sticking around for this video on line shapes. In the next video we'll talk briefly about importing DXF files. Thanks and bye for now.